Empire Szechuan Kitchen. Delivery. Hello? Hello? Thank you. 
file a complaint oh, with the management. Please don't believe that. JR, take the front. JR, take the front, will you? Fucking numb nuts. All right, let's go. Move the fucking thing. Oh, man. All I got is niggas and retards. No wonder they let you out of prison. You're too fucking dumb to be in jail. You better use that word for man. It ain't right. It ain't what? It ain't right? What is this, fucking Sunday school? Listen, I'm just saying you ain't got no right to use that word. Jamie, fight your own battles, man, not but mine. What are you gonna do about it? Wash my fucking wop mouth out with soap? Huh? Mr. Sensitive? God, you piece of shit! Come on, shut up, man. Look, you're gonna lose us our job. Hey, I had a problem with that shit know, every day. I know, I know, I couldn't do nothing look, about it. I know, but it ain't nothing. Well, he's the one with the money. He can't treat people look, like he's that. he's the one with the money. Oh, no. Well, I just did. So get the fuck out of here. Hey, you know what you are? I pity you, because you know what you are? You're an ignorant, racist, Come unfair <laughs> fucking motherfucker. It's unjust, Pete. It's fucking unjust. The thing that is, nobody takes any pride anymore, you know? And if you're gonna do something if so facto, you know, take pride in it. Who are you, the Iacocca? I'm washing windshields. I mean, how much pride do you want them to take? It's a principle to think, Patty. And nobody in this country has a work ethic anymore. Hey, it's a new car, buddy. Watch your blood pressure. Don't freak out. Jesus Christ, Jamie, look at you. Come here, come here. Mom, I've lived to see you like this. She wallowed me real good. Hey, Patty, move the car. But you know I hate driving in the city, okay? If something happens, I'm not responsible. Thought you were getting out next month. Well, what's the matter with you? Why don't you call me? You can afford a car like that? Yeah, what do you think? What's with this? Why are you doing this? Just so I get on my feet. I hope you get back on your feet. I know what it's like to get out. Oh, yeah? <laughs> you ever been in? No, because I went for you. All right. But come on, man, wash your windshields. I mean, you know what people think of these guys? Where's your pride? I've been counting the days till you get out. I don't want to see you throwing your life down the toilet. This is me. I mean, you're my brother, for Christ's sakes. You know, you deserve an honest living. What you do is illegal. What's illegal? You rip people off! No, not people. Things. Houses, stores, trucks. Never people. You don't know the difference between right and wrong. You never did. Oh, yeah, right. So what you're doing is so right, huh? Is that it? I mean, what do you do? Uh, you stand here on the streets, stopping cars, importuning people. The only difference between what you do and what I do is you make a nickel for doing it. Me? I make a bona fide QED living. Listen, Gil. I want to get it right this time, OK? I want a life. I want a family. I'd like a home. I'd like a roof over my head. You know, if I just had a fucking roof over my head, I'd do all right. Max Khan, man. I got a record now. You know what that means? Huh? A blot. A blemish. You know what I say? I say when you got to sit. Pop it. Come on. I want to introduce you to somebody. No. Hey, hey. Come on, come here. Any chance of our getting moving here, like in the present millennium? Shut up. Jamie, this is Patty, the love of my life. Patty? Jamie. Jamie? Oh my God, Gilly, he's out! Oh, congratulations! You must feel so empowered. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Watch your fingers. Do me a favor, will you? Get in the car. I'm empowered. You don't watch this from California. <laughs> get in the car. Jamie, get in the fucking car, man. It's for your own good. No. Get in the fucking car. Jamie, get in the fucking car! Look what you made me do. All right, fine. 
All right? Why don't you fight everybody's battles, you know? Stand up for your principles. You'll be shit-canned in a week. Not this time. I ain't standing up for nobody but me anymore, Gil. All right. Don't know the answer, man, okay? I failed the fucking test. Uh, senor, this has nothing to do with immigration. It's confidential. Only after 71 years do your records become available to other government agencies, and that's not till 2069. Bueno, come back then. I thought this shit was anonymous. It is virtually. Only sworn censors have access to individual records. You a sworn censor? Yes, sir, I am. I ain't gonna give you diddly. Sir, unfortunately, I'm not allowed to guess. I have to have your specific name. Look, rum pool stilt skin, get out of my office. Hey, what about me? I already counted you. So, I voted twice. Why can't it be counted twice? <laughs> people, uh, excuse me, people, could I have your attention, please? I don't think you understand. I am an official representative of the United States government. What are you taking some kind of poll? Oh, shit. It's not a poll, it's a census. Really? You counting people here? Anywhere you call home. Nobody calls us home. How much they pay for that? Eight bucks an hour. Eight bucks an hour? Well, if you fill out the forms really fast, you can work two hours and put in for 20. The thing is, it's by domicile, so no matter how many occupants, you gotta count them all. Get the fucking Bowery, man. That's my fourth shelter, and they're all full to the gills. Do you realize how many of you guys there are? When a place is empty, I had one once. They were converting it to condos. It was great. The landlord had forced out all the tenants. 80 empty units. Filled out 80 forms in an hour. 300 bucks. So you need any special education or qualifications for this? Can you fill in a circle? How's that? Congratulations. You can work for the U.S. government. I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States. The Constitution of the United States. Against all enemies. Against all enemies. Foreign and domestic. Foreign and domestic. And I will well and faithfully. And I will well and faithfully. Discharge the duties of a Census Bureau enumerator. Discharge the duties of a Census Bureau enumerator. So help me God. So help me God. Uh, good day, sir. My name is James Meadows, and I'm an enumerator with the United States Census Bureau. Uh, we've yet to receive any information from this address, so I was wondering if perhaps I could ask you a few Excuse questions. Me. Yes, sir? Go fuck yourself. Miss, no, I'm not a crackhead. I work for the government. Look, I'm a trained census taker. See? You senseless, all right. Laura! Laura, come here. Come look at this crackhead. He's got the stupidest smile. <laughs> oh, yeah! Excuse me. You don't gotta be so rude. 
Valerie and Stuart Margeson. M-A-R-G-E-S-O-N. Just the two of us. Uh, now married, ma'am? Well... Stuart's the head of household. He's 69, he's a bond trader, and he earns 200,000 a year. No offense, ma'am, in this difficult time, but is Mr. Markerson deceased? Mustn't you count all the occupants? He's still an occupant. Does this person speak any other language than English at home? No. And you don't have to whisper. His hearing aid is off. What, uh, how well does Mr. Margeson speak English? Would you say very well, well, not well, or not at all? I suppose I'd have to say not at all. Um, could this person have taken a job in the last week? No. Uh, no already has a job or no temporarily ill or no for other reasons? Other reasons? Meadows, and I'm an enumerator. I'm an enumerator with the United States, uh, the United States Census Bureau, and, and our records show that um, we haven't received any information from this address. So I was hoping that perhaps you could help me by filling out some forms. Oh, I, I am Chinese. I do not speak English. Now, you see, we have to count everybody. It doesn't matter if you're Chinese, if you're Eskimo, or if you're a Martian. If you're here on the 15th, it's our job to count you. It really doesn't matter if you speak English or not, because as long as you can just answer yes or no, I'll fill in the dots. You know, this isn't really my full-time job. I'm a writer. I write books. So I'm actually gathering material for my next one right now. Who was it? I think it was Arthur Conan Doyle once said that if you could lift the roofs off all the houses in the city, what interesting stories you'd find. But instead of lifting roofs off the houses, I just uh, knock on the, the doors. Oh, uh, hi, I'm James Meadows. I'm with the United States Census Bureau. Um, he says, nice to meet you. Oh, thank you. Nice to meet you, ma'am. Okay. Um, do you mind if I ask you who the head of the household is? Yes. No, no, the, her, the lady. I mean, Mrs. Wang Chunghua. Excuse me? I, I'm the house lady. Madame Wang Chunghua. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought, you... can you spell that for me? Your name? Um, Wang Chunghua. <laughs> no, uh, I mean, spell your name for me, Wang Chunhua. Oh. That means spring flower. And uh, how old is your husband? 60 year old. 60? 60, okay. All right. 
There's a part two to this questionnaire. Um, these are just some questions to sample households to give us a fuller picture of your lifestyle. Uh, needless to say, everything is going to be kept strictly confidential by the Census Bureau. So, um, how long have you been here in New York? Here? New York, how long? Oh, um, one year. One year, okay. And why did you come here? Marry my husband. He is energy. Energy? Electrical energy. Uh-huh. Okay. And how do you describe your relationship at this present time? Is it happy, not so happy, or unhappy? I'm sorry, it's just, you know, just the official census data. Happy. Happy. Okay. And uh, would you describe yourself as someone who has a lot of friends at this moment? No friends. So would you say that you're a lonely person? No. But not lonely. Hmm. No. Is there anyone we left out? I guess that about does it then. Well, I'm behind for Uncle Sam of the United States Census Bureau. I want to thank you very much for your time. Thanks for being so kind to me. So much for that. Hey, who's this? So it's really good to meet you. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. And uh, good luck with your English. Thank you. You know, I used to be an English teacher before I was a writer, and I was thinking maybe I could give you English, well, English lessons sometime if you're interested, you know? Oh, thank you. But my English is unusually bad. Thank you. Oh, wait a minute. Is that a yes or a no? Thank you. I guess they usually charge about $20 an hour. 20? Yeah, but in your case, I was thinking more like 10. But five. Five. How's five? Five? Five an hour? Five? Five. Five's fine. Five is fine. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, Hey, 
Hey, Martinez, what is this about not getting paid till the end of next week? I already put in a full week. What about it? You'll take your money and we'll never see you again. We train you. We want at least two weeks of work out of you guys. What is this, government policy? That's my policy. Tony, what about the tape decks? Wait. How much? Our written Rolling Stone digital videos going for the roof. How much? And an item that would sell for five ninety nine at Uncle Steve's. I'll give it to you for a low price, two hundred dollars. Why don't you quote me a low, low price, one fifty? Right, one seventy five. One fifty. <laughs> All right, I'll tell you what. I'll give it to you for one sixty. What's fifteen bucks between friends? Yeah. Tony, come on, man. We've been doing business a long time, right? I'm embarrassing me in front of my people here. I'm uh, Just say 160, I'll take 150. I'll make the difference, all right? We got a fine sale day. Good luck, people. I'm she, but it will fight that luck. One forty. How much do you owe me? Don't be stupid. Don't be stupid. How much? Fifty thousand dollars. Where is it? I don't see you handing me a check. Never bargain with me. I want something. What's your job? I want your firstborn son. I get it. Body of Christ. Amen. Body of Christ. Body of Christ. Christ. Whatever. Gil, where's praying actually gonna get us? Patty, please. I'm, I'm just trying to get a little spiritual guidance here. Well, how about $50,000? I mean, if we're going to be hanging out in the church, maybe we should be passing out the collection plate because uh, I don't hear any great ideas coming from up on high. The other day I'm waiting online. This guy comes up to me. He asked me for money. All right? Ask me for money like it's free. I said to him, listen, this is not cotton balls. It doesn't grow on trees, okay? Do me a favor, get a job. Right? Do something with your life. Why don't you go rob somebody? You know? Earn it, right? That's all I'm saying. So what does he do? This motherfucker, he pulls a knife on me. He mugs me, he takes my money. You believe that? What, what the hell is this world coming to? How you doing? Um, I'm learning English. No, no it's, it's not what are you doing, it's how you doing. All right, sit down, let's try it again. Let's try it again, I'll come in. How you doing? You are welcome. No, how you doing is sort of like, how do you do or how are you? In New York, we just say, how you doing? So you don't really say you are welcome. How you doing? How you doing? Right, and then you can say a whole lot of things. You say, I'm great, I'm fine, I'm okay, I've been better. Hey, how you doing? How you doing? Pretty, pretty good. Pretty good. So how you doing? Mm, fine. Okay, excellent. Not bad. Great. So-so. Hang in there. 
terrible. Yeah, it's actually a very nice place you have here. Oh, tea, good. Chinese tea from China. It's my English book from middle school in China. I can read. <clears throat> Comrade Wang, we cut wheat with the poor and lower middle peasants. They gave us lessons in class struggle. We criticized Jiang Qin's counter. We criticized Jiang Qin's counter-revolutionary revisionist line together. Comrade Li, the workers and the poor and the lower middle peasants are our good teachers. We must earnestly receive re-education from them. Comrade Wang, yes, we must learn from them. I'm going to military training. Goodbye. Can I see that? Nineteen seventy-seven. It's like a Chinese Berlitz. Checking in at the post office. How to interrogate American spies? <laughs> very old and stupid book. No, it's a very good book. It's just not very practical. You know, I was thinking more of an everyday man's, you know handy use of the English language, things you really need to get by. Hurt? Just how to tell somebody to fuck off if need be. That's a bad word, I think. Yeah, but it's a very useful word in most vocabularies. All right, I tell you what. Let's do a Wang and Lee dialogue, only New York style. You're very good looking, right? So you must have a lot of guys that try to hit on you. Hate me? No, 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 not, not hit you, I mean, pick you up, ask you for a date. You know, so say, say a guy comes up to you and he says, uh, what time is it? Oh, time is 3.30 o'clock. It's 3.30, right? So say he takes your hand like this and he looks at your watch. He says, oh, sorry, baby, right here. It says it's time for you to have a drink with me. Okay, now say you don't like me. You don't like me. <laughs> I mean, what would you say if you didn't like me? Fuck off. <laughs> right, well, that works for me. No, but I mean, if you didn't want to be so rude, what you could say is, oh, no, darling, I think the time to have a drink with me was an hour ago. And then you just get up and walk away. No, 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 wait, 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 I don't mean really walk away. All right, say a guy comes up to you on the street and he says, uh, hey, baby, I just moved into town. Why don't you <laughs> show me the way to your apartment? What would you say to him? I don't like this man. I say to her... No, no, no. Him. Him. Him? Mm -hmm. Him. I, I, I say to him, you go to 50th Street, number 10. Ask for Miss Chen. You got it. Give me five. <laughs> All right, forget it. I think you got it. Too. You really, you're doing good. Very good. Yes. I think I learn very fast. And I think you're very beautiful. Then I say, you're ugly. Go away. <laughs> no. I mean, I think that you are very, very beautiful. Excuse me, please. Fang Fang wants his milks. Fang Fang? Yes, Fang in English is square. Square, square. Hi, I'm square, square. It's okay, let's not worry about the money. No, here. Look, I don't need your money, okay? I must have paid. Yeah, you're right. I'm, 
I'm sorry. Thanks. I'll see you around. Excuse me, miss. Here it says to list all other accounts. Oh, just list all other current accounts. The name of the bank and the account number. Oh, it's uh, none. None? Not a single bank account? No, it's primarily why I want to open this one. Well, we usually like to have some kind of financial reference, uh, a bank or a major credit card. Oh. Here's my financial reference, cash. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, sir. I, I misunderstood. Um, of course, we'd be delighted to be of service. How much did you wish to deposit initially? $23. Old Leo is still making me go to parties. The Americans are friendly, but the men look at me rudely, and I can't always understand what they're saying. One drunk man keeps telling me, you have beautiful ass. I yelled at him and said he couldn't insult me like that. Then I found out he was saying, I had beautiful eyes. In English, these words are almost the same. Sorry if my writing is a little jiggly. I am happy because I have started taking English lessons. My teacher says I'm his best student. Have you started your final exams? I know you'll get the highest score. Remember, you must always study diligently so you can become the most successful architect in China. The little emperor is getting very handsome, just like his father. He can sit up now, which makes him conceited. I can't stop thinking of you. I just found out they turned down my go-kart application. <laughs> hey, Jamie! Oh, man. Yeah, no home address. Hey, Jamie, come on, man. I just want to talk. About what? About what? I want to see how you're doing. I'm fine, Gil. Hey, hey, hey. Come on, let me see, huh? You're my brother, for Christ's sake. What do you want, Gil? Do I got to always want something? Uh, I just want to see if you're all right. Come here. Hmm? Give me a hug. Give me a hug. What's the matter? You're too good to hug your brother? No. Huh? Huh? No. Huh? <laughs> So how you doing with those prospects? Fine, I got another job, all right? I just don't get a paycheck till Friday. And what kind of job? At the census department. I'm an enumerator. What the fuck is an enumerator? I go in people's houses and I count them. Really? They just let you in? Yeah, they give me like a photo ID. It's like a badge. A badge, huh? That's pretty intriguing. Think maybe you can get me one of these badges? Oh, yeah, right. No fucking way, Gil. You realize what we could do? I mean, it's like having a fucking invitation, you know? Please, Mr. Census Man, come on in, case my joint. Locate my fence items. Listen to me, all right? We can make more money in a week than you make in a month counting other people's babies. I'm telling you, Jamie, God gives you a boon like this, you gotta use it. I mean, otherwise it's like a sin, you know? Well, it's very persuasive, Gil. All of a sudden, you got logic and religion. Why don't you just stick to the tried and true methods? You want something pulverized, man. If you don't want to take advantage of your assets, fine. Far be it for me. But I'm not going to stand by and watch your meadows wash windshields in the Bowery. You understand me? Right? Hey. I don't need your money. Well, look at it as in advance, all right? We'll deduct it from your first I don't job. want your money. You know, I already got one lined up, you know? It's a real sitter, huh? We just waltzed right in there. Last time I went waltzing, it was in the Rikers Island ballroom, thanks to you. I'll tell you what, I'll do the waltz and you just open it up. Hey, come on, take it. I don't want your money, okay? It's yours, all right? I don't need any money laying in the street. I don't need $100. I don't need $100 either. Come on, take it. No! God damn it. Jamie, stop acting like you're better than me. Take the fucking money. No! You, man. You know, it's getting cold out here. Yeah. You know, you're scaring the shit out of me, all right? You could die out here. Nobody laughs on these streets. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna die, right? Look, I know what I'm doing, Gil. Yeah, right, you know what you're doing, Gil. Yeah, sure. You know what I'm gonna prick. Look, it ain't that I don't appreciate what you're trying to do for me. Fuck you! 
You know how much you gross the first three quarters? 110,237.33. Conservatively, after Tony LaFat's cut, okay, irregardless of the 50,000 that you owe him, that's 40,000 net. And you don't pay taxes. Now, how much do we have in the bank? 8,000. So, of that uh, 32,000 that you blew, how much did you spend on me? Well, according to my calculations, not including what you pay me to do the books, $904.76. We can round that up to 905. You know what that means, Gil? It means you're cheap. Uh, uh, uh. You know, at least when he was on Rikers Island, Patty, I didn't have to worry about him. I mean, he's such a dreamer. And the kid, he hasn't got a fucking clue about life or anything else. He's gonna fuck up again. He needs direction. Guidance. And you're certainly the ideal person to give it to him. I know. The perfect way to learn English is to sing songs in English like kids do. You know what a round is? Around, it's like when I start a song and then you just repeat everything I do a couple words later. You know, like, Frere Jacques, Frere Jacques. I know, I know, Chinese song. Da dao tu hao, da dao tu hao, fen tian di, fen tian di, gong da jia zuo zu. Okay, okay, that's good, but we're learning English here, so in English it goes, Frere Jacques, Frere Jacques, dorme wu, dorme wu, dorme wu, dorme wu. Send me that. Send me learn. Wait a minute. What the hell am I doing? I... I sing no good? No, you sing fine, but I'm trying to teach you English, so... Uh, when me and my brother Gil were kids, they used to send us up to this summer camp to get us out of the city, right? And ever since I can remember, we'd learn these little songs that... Oh, I know. How about... Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Come on now, now you do it. Row, row, row oh, your boat oh, gently oh, down the stream. Down the street. No, not street, stream, the street. You can't row boat. What? No, 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 come on. You can do it. <laughs> row, row, row your boat. It'll help gently down the stream. So, row, row. Your boat, boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Life. Come on, Fang. Row, 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 your row, boat, row, gently row, down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a life dream. Now loud, row, row, really loud. Row, your boat gently down, down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Oh, it means, you know, row, row. Oh, hmm. Huachuan. Huachuan, Huachuan. Um, what means merrily? What means merrily? Uh, what does merrily mean? Merrily means, um, happy, happy. Oh, they're happy, they're row their boat. Yeah, they're happy because they're going down the stream, yeah. Happy. Who? The guy in the boat. Oh. Hey man, go celebrate. Very sorry. No speak English, stupid peasant girl. You 
you know what I miss? What? Taking a bath. <laughs> yeah, taking a bath, man. I mean, we always have to take showers. You're just as clean taking a shower. Mm-mm, mm-mm. No, you don't get just as clean taking a shower because you're washing all your essential oils right out of you. Now, see, with a bath, you can lay back in the water. Now, you're still getting clean, but you're sitting there in your own oils. It's healthier. It's like recycling your organisms. You ever think about trying to improve yourself? Every night for 18 months in that cell. I know. You and me both. Well, how can you when you're out on the street, huh? You know, you get off the street, and then you can improve yourself. Take one of them self-improvement courses. Yeah. <laughs> one of them 12-step programs, right? <laughs> Lord. Yeah, stab master for your soul. You should have been a minister, Jay. I was a minister. In my own right, you know. Problem is, I'm, I'm really ashamed, man. I, mean, I go to church, but I ain't got no money when they pass the collection plate. You ever go to church? I don't go to church no more. Yeah, see, you should go to church. You took your little narrow ass to church, you wouldn't feel so low. I ain't feeling low. I'm just biding my time here, man. I know, yeah, you bide your time, you <clears throat> bide your time, you bide your time. Next thing you know, you ain't got no time left to bide. Which one is outside, huh? No, 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 no. I ain't here for no rock. I'm taking a census. Taking a what? It's like a survey. We count people. What you want to count us for? We all here. We're getting paid. Yo, this is better if you know jokes. It's no joke. My mama lives here. It's cool, man. Look, maybe you can answer some questions. Yeah, well, I got to be on the street. I'm getting paid. All right, how much does your mother make? I don't know. Not fucking much. Okay, not fucking much. And what about these sisters? Do any of them work? Nah, man, they too young. So how about you? What are you making? 300 a week. 300 a week. Some nice sneakers you got there. Yeah. I got three fans. 300 a week times 50 weeks, that's um, 15 grand, 15 grand a year. Yeah, <laughs> not bad. Not bad. That's a little loose. I thought your aunt said this was furnished. It is. 
I'll need two references with phone numbers. So cockroaches come with the place or I have to pay extra? Look, Wiseacre, if you're interested, I want to check for $200 as a deposit. I can tell you, serious. Gee, I must have left my checkbook at home. Get off that thing, will you? Jimmy? Got to oh, wow. Hey, man, how's it going? Bobby Chacon, I'm telling you, he's a badass, man. You should see him now. His face looks like the same bloody. See you still in Washington. Okay. Thank you very much. Oh, no. Oh, my God, no cops. No cops, no cops. What happened to the videos? Can I tell you, I was misinformed. I only have what he is. Fortune cookies? It's not, you don't like fortune cookies? No, I don't. My fortunes never come true. you keep secret in the bank because of all the tellers. Why do they put a fence around the graveyard? Because so many people are dying to get in. Pointing at somebody, you know, you're flipping them the bird, you're telling them, fuck off, like that. Fuck off. All right, but it, it, that sounds like a Russian name, fuck off. It's fuck off. <laughs> fuck off. Say it from here. <laughs> fuck off. Fuck off. Get the fuck off. I say it. Fuck off. 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 That was pretty good. I think you got <laughs> Which other words? Oh, there's all kinds. You sit at a light and the guy crosses and gets stuck in good luck. You say, you bastard. You What's that? Bastard. It's like, you know, the opposite of bitch, but it's it, it's bitch? a whole vocabulary. Hey, hey, excuse me. I really, really need five dollars, man. You don't know how much. Yeah, yeah sure. Oh, okay. thank you so much. God bless you, man. God bless you. Thank you. So God damn it, I said five dollars. And what does he give you? I need five, man. He gives me one. And I said five dollars. What does he give you? He gives me one. No, two minutes. Right, take it easy. Come on, Don't do that, please. Come on. That's mine. That is mine. You got a minute. You got a minute. Oh, what the hell are you doing? All right. What are you, not? Asshole. It's OK. <laughs> You're learning. Where are you from in China? Peking? <laughs> Peking? No, we say Beijing. Oh. But I have a boyfriend there, student. You had a boyfriend there. Past tense, you say had. Had. I'm a bad soup. I like colors, I like yes. crazy. <laughs> I like up. I'm what that man's bad. doing? No, it's uh, Tai Chi. Tai Chi? New York style. <laughs> Many people like that here. Yeah. I am born near Yangzhou in Zhejiang province, the east. I was champion rifle shooter in my school. Get out of here. Yes. What did you shoot at? U.S. imperialist dog aggressors? Yes. No, get out of here. <laughs> in our imaginary nations. 
My husband is not want me to go back to China. Well, it's your decision, isn't it? It's my fate. It's not your fate. You do what you want. I always do what I want to, but she will not pay ticket. He. 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 He will not pay for the ticket. He's afraid Fang Fang will see his father.老刘刚出差，你就这样了，跟大鼻子跑出去。老刘可不喜欢你跟这人在一起啊，他只是我的英文老师。那你这次怀孕是用英语的了？他只是我的朋友。哼，各位，都问菲菲。哦哦哦，
How you doing? Good. <laughs> Sorry. It's, no, it's good. Strong. <laughs> What do you think? Nice brownstone. I hear. Now, this is not first hand information, but I hear that they got these hairless pussies. <laughs> <laughs> Don't talk about her like that. Oh, yeah? Why is that? Hmm? You in love with her or something like that? Huh? Huh? I'm very impressed. <laughs> My brother, the romantic. She's got a little kid. Here we go. The bitch is that she's got the husband, and the husband, I'm pretty sure he's got a little... Yeah? How much? This guy got a lot of money? I don't know, but I, I told her I was an author and I was interested in this million dollar condo and she didn't even flinch. Well, at least you've been straight with her. <laughs> Tell you what, Gil, if I had a girl like that, I'd, I'd straighten my life up good. I, I swear I'd be back in the right track again. You know what I think? I think you've been drinking too much. No shit. Let me ask you something, kid. How come you didn't talk? Hmm? How come you didn't rat me out? I didn't talk because you're my brother. My brother. Brothers. Brothers. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you something, all right? A lot of people, they wouldn't have done the same thing that you did. Listen to me. I want you to know I love you for that. I mean it. I love you, you know? Fucking A, love you. <clears throat> remember that time we went to summer camp and you fell in the lake? You remember I dove in after you and I saved you? So? <laughs> I want you to know something, all right? I would dive in there after you again, you know that. Gil, I didn't fall in the lake. You pushed me. I pushed you. I don't remember that. Oh, for your grandma. I'm very fun. We, we, we shall go. Yeah, if you want. Yes. Ah, right, where you think you're going? Hey, is there a problem here? Yeah, I need to check your friend's bag for a second. Why? We think we should uh, inspect her bag. Are you making an accusation here? We think there's something in her bag, sir. Nah, I know there's something in her bag. She got CDs in her bag. She knows. No, no, no. No, no, no. Go ahead. Go ahead. You want to treat her like a shoplifter? Go ahead. But what are you going to... Hey, wait. Back off. Yo, man. Yo, I'm doing my job, man. Everything's cool. We just need to check her bag. What are you going to do if you're wrong, huh? 
You're gonna just give her the okay, CDs? Listen, she's not leaving the store until we check the bag. No, please. I... No, no, it's okay. It's okay. Let him check your bag. Please. It's okay. Give me. Check. You got it. She had at least three or four in there. Check right over here. Check this one. Hey, look, you just satisfied? Yo, I know there's something in there, man. It's not there. He checked, all right? It's not there. You did your job. You fucked up. Now apologize. Nah, man. I'm not apologizing. I saw her take apologize, CDs from right over fucker, and get yourself some glasses. Yeah, I can see fine, man. Yeah, right. It was a simple mistake, okay? Store policy. Yeah, to treat your customers like criminals? She didn't come to this country to be treated like no criminal or punks like you. Yeah, man. Enjoy your CDs. Kiss my ass. I'm really sorry about the way I acted in that story. No, no, I, I am really sorry. The guy had no right to treat you like that, you know, and you can't let him get away with it, because if you do, they're just gonna shit all over you. That's right, it's another vocabulary word, shit. Shit. I, I'm, I'm sorry, but you gotta stand up for yourself, you know? There's just sometimes you just gotta have a little self-respect, because they don't care how they treat you. You know, people judge themselves by who they think they're better than. And that's what this country's all about. Who's doing better than you? Because believe me, if you're penniless, people pretend that you don't exist. They look right through you. And then it's all the way until you start to believe it. And then there's nothing in here, you know? And then you really do have nothing. Yes. You must be happy. You are rich. There we go. Thank you. I'll get him. No, I'll get him. I'll get him. I'm criminal. No, Chinua, wait. I'm criminal. It's okay. Wait. Listen. Chinua. Chinua, I could have bought these for you. Yeah, right, Mr. Big Spender. Now we're Take smuggling it. immigrants. They're all yours. We shouldn't be doing this, Gil. We're doing it this way with Teamsters, all right? Tony Lofat gives us a delivery, we deliver it. It's gonna be all right, Jamie, come on. I don't know, maybe I drank too much coffee in an empty stomach. I can't find this fucking place. Should be somewhere around here. 37, 87, 87, 37. I hate fucking Queens. There's two addresses for every house. It's fucking crazy. Well, what do you expect? They got nothing but cemeteries out here. They got more dead people than live ones. <laughs> yeah, more dead. They're all dead, these fucks. Hey! Jamie, get the other one! Get in there! Get him! Where is he? Where is he? I can't find him. What do you mean you can't find him? This is gonna cost me, Jamie. You fucking let me down, man. Come on. Come on, get in there. Come on, drive around the block. Sit behind me. How much is she worth to you? How much? Everything. No, 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 no. What I always tell you, don't overvalue things. Let's put her at 
Say 50,000. That's what I came here to talk to you about. I got a plan with the huge upside. No plans, no upsides. You drive away with four men, you deliver three. I want my $50,000 now. Jesus, where am I gonna get 50,000? No! Not Jesus, not Jesus. Me, Tony Low Fat. I'm your only savior here. You got a week, huh? You wanna see her chew? Please don't hurt her. Please. Talk some sense into him. He should pay. Because I'll kill you. Myself. You believe that, don't you? You know what? Fuck Tony Low Fat. And fuck you, because for five grand or five hundred grand, I ain't doing it. Would you just shut up for a minute? Let me talk you into this. You don't even have to be there. There's nothing in this world gonna make me do that to her. It's got nothing to do with her, all right? We just boogie in, we grab some stuff, and we boogie out. Look, I wouldn't ask you to do this, but I'm under some pressure here, Jamie. I don't come up with 50,000 for Tony Low Fat. I mean, instantaneously. You're gonna find Patty and me in a couple of bags somewhere in Jersey. So sell your precious fucking car. I can't, okay? I leased my precious fucking car. <sighs> now, who's more important anyway, huh? Her or me? I'm family. Blood is thicker than love. Besides, it's only material fucking possession. It's my life. I'm in control now. What? I'm not in control of my life? It's my life this time, okay? It's Jamie Meadows, and I'm in control of my life. I could force you to do it. <laughs> Preferential, you do it on your own. Yeah, you can force me to do it, all right. Those days are done, asshole. Oh, yeah? I suppose I go over to Chung King's house. It's Shun Hua. Whatever. Right? I go over there, I tell you you're a phony. Okay, you're penniless. You got no million dollar condo, no books. You're not even an English teacher. What you are is a creative truth teller. I think even in Chinese, that adds up to be a liar. So go tell her, okay? Go fucking tell her, I don't care. Fine, that's what I'll do, I'll tell her. I'm not helping you rip off her house, forget about it. Oh, go tell her. He's a goddamn communist. Don't ring that fucking bell. Hey! Don't ring the bell. Come Get on. your hands off me, all right? I told you I'm serious. Come on, don't do it. You... All right, look, there's nobody home. Come on, let's go. Get off. Now, how you doing? Uh, is uh, Chun Ya home? Who's asking for her? Excuse me? Who's asking for her? Oh, a friend. Good friend. Good friend? Yeah, friend. One moment. Fucking asshole. Okay. Okay, what? Okay, I'll get you the goddamn key. Come on. Sure. I'm fucking sure. sure. Come on. All right. <laughs> fucking. <laughs> Is that person? I don't know. They look the same. Is that person sleeping with that person? So what do you think? My mother bought me a picture book about tell the weather by observing of the sky, hoping my staring at the air can become educational. <laughs> I did 
dinner, I said,、uh, the red sky predicts high wind and storm, and fish scale clouds suggests the rain. I was feeling I had something important to say. Do you know how much cost for airplane to China? No. One thousand and two hundred dollars. You know your husband might not like you just taking off at Fang Fang. Too bad he's not a father. I was in a school where they send if you do wrong things near Yangzhou. Like reform school. That's you know, where they send you when they say you're bad. Yes. I went to reform school. You? Yeah. That's where I got all my bad habits from. <laughs> They were extremely similar. What they put you in there for? For my love affair. My parents tried making giving me an abortion. I told them, "Send me to prison. I don't care. I will keep my baby." My parents found Liu Weiyan. He's an important businessman and party member. They want me to marry so my baby not born in our village without a father. My family does not lose face. Very lucky for me. Why don't you marry the real father? Don't be. You? you know, wouldn't marry you. Took off or something. No. I want it extremely much. But his student going to Beijing, no money. He must study hard, become a big success. With a baby. They roll their boat. It's like a little house, our little house. Shuma, I gotta tell you something. I haven't been completely honest with you. Well, you know that that condo we went to see, you know, that apartment. I, I'm never gonna be rich enough to afford that, you know. You? But your apartment is already very big. Yeah.
机怎么了？这么冷天，你站这儿干嘛呀？我怎么又被钥匙搞忘了？老是丢三忘四的。Here's a hundred. That's one thousand two hundred ninety-seven dollars and fifteen cents. You've really been saving. Yeah, three hundred more dollars. I'm gonna have my own place. Oh, great. Chair. Cheers. Do you like my dress? I like your dress very much. You do? You do? Yes. You like? Yes. You're beautiful. My ears are red. Yeah, they're pretty red. They're pretty, Jimmy. Are you sure he gave you the right keys? Shut up. Of course he gave me the right keys, my brother, for Christ's sake. God damn it. Gil, you see anything? Ethan? I ain't got no stereos, no Japanese TVs. All I got is American crap. Find anything? No, it's all garbage. Everything's made in Taiwan. At least I gotta have some silver. I'm gonna be kidding you, fucking chopsticks. Gil, this is something, man. Oh, man, that's a piece of shit. We won't get anything for it. You think so? Well, what are these people, fucking peasants? They got nothing to steal. <laughs> Chinese kids are cute, huh? Take a walk. What did you say to me? We need a moment here, Patty. Tell me you're not lying to me. If you stole that. I kid. didn't steal anybody! It's a misunderstanding! Now get out of here! Now look what you've done. This wasn't supposed to happen. You gave me the wrong set of keys, Mr. Screw Up. You weren't even supposed to get in. It's the only item of value. Item of item of value? Jesus Christ. Tony Little Fat said he's gonna broker a deal. It'll be adopted. You know how much male babies mean to Chinese people. There's all kinds of couples out there that give anything for a boy, no questions asked. This is so bad. This is so fucking 
it. Do you even know what you've done? Look, he said he was gonna kill Patty. What was I supposed to do? I couldn't let him hurt her. I mean, besides, the kid's better off. At least it'll grow up to be American. And what about her? You're just gonna ruin her life? I'm sorry, I really am. What gives you the right to decide who's happy and who's not? Look, somebody has to. It might as well be me. You gotta give that kid back. You don't think that I would if I could? It's too risky. The ransom drop, it's too risky. Oh, you fucking bullshit. You are such fucking bullshit. No, 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 no. No. You're bullshit, okay? The only reason you give a fuck is because you got the hots for that fortune cookie. I'm fucking bloody. Ah! Huh? I'm your flesh and blood, and I'm doing this for your own good. I'm the only one that gives two fucks about you, and you better get it through your fucking head. You hear me? All I want is a good life for you. What, like yours? Fucking up to your nose and death to scum. You're like, fuck! What are you, huh? Just a fucking paragon. I had the moral beacon. I'm telling her, Gil. I'm telling her everything. Yeah, go ahead and tell her. Go ahead. She's gonna hate you. She's gonna hate you worse than you've ever been hated in your life. Is that what you want? Go ahead! I'll tell you what. Unless we're gonna go at it again, I'm gonna get the kid a fucking bottle. doesn't know anything. They think kind of find him. I'm sure they're doing everything they can. She won't listen to me. I think I know what happened. You know what happened? No, no, no. I, I, I just... What do you know? Please tell me. No. What? Tell me. What do you know? I just, I, I think I know what you're going through. That's all. You know? Look, Shinwa, if you could, you know, maybe if the three of us could just, if you could run away, just, just leave this all behind us, would you? Shinwa, I'm, I'm so in love with you. Can you find him? Can you find him for me? I must go inside now. Ten, eleven, twelve hundred. That leaves only ninety seven dollars and three cents. That's less than a hundred dollars. Yeah, I know. I need it for a plane ticket. Oh, are you going away? On vacation? Yeah, sort of. Jamie? Yeah. <laughs> this is how this thing works, Pat. Oh, yeah. So I give the dog the medicine, and when all the worms came out, it was like a fucking bowl of spaghetti on the floor. I mean, that was a fucking lot of worms, man. Baby, shut the fuck up. I didn't want to pick it up. So what are you guys going to do? Oh, we'll be OK. You better go. Uh, you should have some more diapers. I'm all set. I got everything. Hey. Thanks. Be like puppies that like I got neighbors, all right. You know what I'm thinking? Patty. Oh, Gil. 
I hope you bought that powdered formula. This can stuff's too expensive when it gives him the boots. Yeah, but don't worry about it. There's, there ain't no baby in that girl. It's a kid. Go, go. Could you fucking do this? I did it for you, Patty. For you. Do you, do you see him? He's, he's fucking gone. He's fucking gone. Fucking asshole. Kill him! It's me, Jamie. Listen, I got Fang Fang. I found him. Where is he? It's okay. He's here with me. Is he fine? Nothing's wrong. He's absolutely perfect. Jamie! Jamie! Where you are? Look, Shinwa, I don't got a lot of time. You gotta come down to Pier 76 on the Hudson River. It's across from 34th Street. You got that? 34th Street? I, I yeah. bought your ticket. If you had a ticket to China, you'd go, right? Jamie! in the boat with that guy. He's got a gun. He's shooting it. I think he kidnapped the baby. No, this is a lie. He called to get he, He's got the baby in the boat. No, he did not do it. I'm just I trying know. to help. Come on. Get in. Come on. Come to see if I don't know. I don't know. I I love this man. You never heard Bumpa. Never. Ma'am, we should call for a chop. Yes, sir, please. Okay, get see you on the phone. I need aviation. I need harbor. I need a couple of diamonds. Call ESU. Come on, do it now. Brother out there. He'll be all right. He knows I wouldn't do anything to hurt him.
China Air announces boarding for flight 43 to Beijing. At this time, all ticketed passengers should proceed directly to gate 18. Fang Fang, Fang Fang, we're going home. We're going to meet your father. We're going home because we have a good friend who helped us. You grow up, I'm like you, like this friend. His song is the first song. Loved and lost, the same as you. So, so you see, I know just, just what you've been through. But if you let me, here's what I'll do. Oh, I've just got to take care of you. You won't ever have to worry. Oh, you won't ever, you won't ever have to cry. That you'll be true For there is no doubt in my mind I know what I want to do And just as sure As one and one is two Oh, oh, no I just got to I just got to take care of you 